ISIS has supposedly followed through on their most recent beheading threat, releasing video that purportedly shows the killing of American Peter Kasich. The video, which has yet to be verified, does not show the actual murder, but instead the aftermath. A masked militant claiming to have killed Kasich video also shows what appears to be the mass killing of captured Syrian soldiers. The U.S. government has yet to confirm Kasich's death. Kasich was shown and threatened in ISIS's previous video. He's a former U.S. soldier turned aid worker and was captured by ISIS in October 2013. While in captivity, he converted to Islam, changing his name to Abdul Rahman Kasig. Kasig's family released a video last month begging for his safe return. We love you, and our hearts ache for you to be granted your freedom. If confirmed, the 26-year-old from Indiana becomes the fifth Westerner beheaded by ISIS, joining James Foley, Stephen Sotloff, David Haynes, and last month, Alan Henning. The U.S. began airstrikes against ISIS in Syria in September, though President Obama has pledged no boots on the ground. Last week, rumors of ISIS leader Abu Bakr al-Baghdadi being gravely injured or possibly killed by a U.S.-led airstrike appeared to be false after ISIS released what they said was an audio recording of him shortly after. He called for supporters to erupt volcanoes of jihad. Kasich's family posted on their Facebook page Sunday that they were still waiting for government confirmation on the authenticity of the video. For Newsy, I'm Matt Moreno.